Hello, my name is Emmanuel Best, and I am currently an SDSU student. Living Writers English 579 is my class, and my professor is Megan Marshall. <clears throat> Please forgive me, I am getting over a slight cold over these December seasons, so if I sound a bit raspy, I do apologize. This is my short creative interpretation of two authors uh, that we've read, Bandana Kana and Marilyn Chen. My creative interpretation poem conveys both the symbolic symbolisms that both authors use. I decided to use an animalistic approach to my poem <clears throat> to symbolize the idea of developing growth and emotion. The use of spiritual growth is something I found constant through both authors. And this is what really inspired me to create this short poem, Emotions Like a Bird. Hope you enjoy. Emotions like a bird. Like a crane, my emotions are still and peaceful. I'm bothered by the storms of life. No matter the intensity, like a crane, I spread my wings far and wide. Humble, open, and transparent. I walk elegantly with purpose. Through the sticks of bamboo, the serene pond, Grease my steps with singular tiny currents of bliss. Like a crane, I am open to my flock. No more hiding. I poke my head up, resting my eyes as I drift into clarity and understanding of what it means to have serenity. Like a hawk, I am always searching for the next prey and ready for action. But not just any prey, but a prey that requires motivation and timing. Timing and motivation is key to my growth and experience of life. Like a hawk, I fly with confidence, fierce and ready for any setbacks. Failure can't stop me. In order to hunt, I must let go of the fear of failure. Like a hawk, I am the divine predator of confidence. I gaze upon fear, self-doubt, depression from above, and this is what I attack before they ever consume me, head on. Like a parent, I've mastered the meaning of joy and social quality. My feathers no longer ruffled and constrained. A ruffled and constrained that only portrayed my hidden insecurities from the inside. Feelings of an unsettling unworthiness, even around my own species. Like a parent, I can bond with other species of my own no longer feeling alienated, no longer feeling the need to hide myself away into the depths of a corner cage. I can finally spread my wings and show my colors. Like a parent, I found my voice and can speak up for myself for the first time. This has been Emotions Like a Bird. Thank you for listening.